I'm Gaz, and this is Let's Quickly Play Hack Slash Loot. Jesus, is that going to be too loud? I don't know. Anyway, this is an independent... Let's turn that down real quick. This is an independent game. Uh, it's a very small-looking uh, roguelike. I haven't done so well. You die a lot in this game, as you do in all roguelikes. Anyway. <coughs> Mask of the Boy King. The Boy King, Neb Kippur, died a wealthy ruler. His followers buried him with his treasures in a well-guarded tomb. Now many centuries later, his tomb has been uncovered, and the riches within lie waiting for anyone brave enough to enter. The greatest of these treasures is the Pharaoh's Mask. A burial mask fashioned from pure gold and worn posthumously by the boy king himself. Rich will be the adventurer, brave enough to venture into the tomb and recover the mask. Um, I already did this one. In fact, I just died doing this one, so... Perhaps, uh... Talk about the grid. You can make this really small if you want it. Okay. Yeah, I, I've already done this one. And the map doesn't seem any different. Maybe it is. This lowers my attack. Uh, you can desecrate these tombs. I'm not going to. Skeletons pop out of them. I imagine that when I get to the tomb that I'm supposed to be going to, I will know what it looks like. Uh, when you die, there are various... Uh, okay, well this, this increases my melee, but I don't think I use melee. So let's not take it. Uh, when you die, you change to a different character. Okay, maybe maybe this is a different thing. Okay, healing spirit. Well, let's take it. I gain two health. Am I safe here? I guess I am. And there's nothing in there. I could try and search through the tombs. Who knows what I'd find. Probably just death. Uh, in the back, you can see that it sort of tells you what's going on. It keeps the combat log and all that. I kind of... I find it kind of distracting. Sometimes it gets in the way. Let's see what the ceremonial scroll does. Gives me five health. Lit torch in a grate in the floor. Can't do anything with it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can move with the keys. Which maybe I should do. else down here? No. Dodging. Well, I don't have magic attack, so I will take it. A lucky scroll. It's a lucky scroll. Two health. Bracers of glory. More defense. I'm 
not normally a fan of roguelikes, but I thought I'd give this a try. Now that just lowers my thing and gives me magic. I don't need it. Uh, I don't really know all there is to play with it, game, or all there is to do in this game. Uh, I just sort of picked it up. So it's possible that I am missing a lot of things. Wound closing. Gave me something, but I couldn't see because... Okay, gave me three health. I don't know if what I'm looking for is actually in one of these tombs. Amber mold, okay. Damn it. I don't think so, though, because last time I played as this guy, I did find... A rope down. Oh, damn. Okay, I need to backtrack now. I'm actually doing really well, which I kind of don't want to be. I'd like to die so I can show you the next uh, next character. Maybe I'll just die on purpose. of glory. It doesn't seem to actually change much, but I'll take it anyway. The enemies in the crypt here aren't very difficult, compared to some of the other things I've seen. In a very short amount of time, let's see what this does. Gives me four health. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna die. Let's uh, desecrate. Ooh, this actually gave me something. What the scroll? The magic I do <laughs> damages me. Uh, skeleton knight. Okay. A new, a new skeleton there. Elemental scroll. Gave me some resistances or something, and now I'm screwed. Now I gotta fight my way out. There we go. Okay. As silence falls, the tomb claims another soul to walk forever, forever walk its cold dark chambers. Okay. Now we go on to a new hero. Dark hearts and evil minds. Deep below the surface of the earth there lies a vast subterranean city. A city filled with black-hearted warriors and evil-minded wizards. Foolhardy would be the poor soul who had ventured there, but as sure as fortune favors the brave, it also, also sometimes favors the reckless. And there are riches to be had deep within the abyss. Legend tells of a mighty suit of armor, helm, and shield that once belonged to a fabled hero. Are you foolhardy enough to quest for them? I guess so, and now I am a wizard. God. I didn't know these guys would open doors. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Uh, is that not a statue to look at? I guess not. Grandfather clock. Uh, deep dwarf blacksmith. Whew. 
Oh crap. Now a noble. Dwarvish bed. Ooh, I'll take that cloak. And I'll take those boots. Can't use the bed. Okay, here's the stairs down. I guess I'll take it. Uh, power crystal. Ooh, gave me a lot of good stuff there. That's good. You can't go back up as soon as you take to the next level. And I'm dead. Death has claimed you. It is better left unsaid what horrors will now befall your lifeless remains. Mask of the Boy King again? No, I'm not having that, so let's, uh, let's die. Because I want to show some of the other characters off. The Scroll of Lori. That uh, gave me something. Come here, Mr. Rat. Am I... I guess I am invulnerable right now. Is that from the sc scroll? I was invulnerable. Okay, you know what? Fine. take that shield, and I'll take that bow. I guess there might be some advantages to desecrating tombs. Not many of them. Uh, okay, I don't need an axe, I'm not a melee. Okay, and I'm dead. Uh, another one of these. Uh, I'll pause until I find something. Okay, here's a new one. Journey to the Kimon. For centuries, the Kimon, or the Demon Gate, had lain undisturbed, but now a powerful... Power... I cannot talk tonight. Powerful Red Oni is threatening to open it once more. If this vile scheme is successful... The world as we know it may be doomed. A brave hero must journey to the Kimon and defeat the Oni before all is lost. Our only hope is a single adventurer. Our only hope is you. Uh, once again, I am the archer. What is potion? Potion that gives me resistance to lightning. I should just stop. Closer to him. Uh, I'm gonna go pick my arrows back up. The longbow, rather. Ooh, what is that? Holy crap! They dwell beneath. Up until now, the denizens beneath the mountain have left the surface folk be, but now something has caused them to become to come forth and raid the surface. Five dragon brothers have made their home within the mountain and are forcing the inhabitants to raid the surface and well swell their horde. Good lord. <sighs> a great hero is needed to enter the twisting caves and put a stop to their evil reign. 
Legend tells of great riches and danger beneath the mountain. Which will you find? Well, I start right next to a kobold sentinel. Some loose coins and ladder. Oh god. Now there is a warrior here. Let's get, holy crap. I don't seem to be spawning as the warrior. Kobolds are weaker than the rats. Uh-oh, I'm poisoned. Uh, I don't know what that means. Scroll of life, perhaps? Will, uh, will it help me? It did. I'll take that ring. Oh, damn you. He was waiting for me. A lizard man. Ooh, what's that? It helps. Whatever it is, I want it. Oh, another one. Well, I'm gonna die soon. and evil minds, deep below the surface of the earth there's lies a vast subterranean city filled with black wars. Okay, well anyway, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what this game is. It's a fun little hack and slash roguelike game. Uh, it's really, <laughs> I think, just meant to be quick and fun and you just go in hacking and slashing and looting, as the name says. So anyway, uh, that's all for now. I will see you next time.